hi this is lola welcome back to my channel today i am doing an unboxing of the stickers that i ordered from bria documented journey of course i am keeping this one because this is an extra one um i ended up ordering more vinyl stickers even though i originally went to get her washi i saw a post on instagram that she had these washi stickers which were really thin and i really do love those um and i ended up getting mostly vinyl because i thought the artwork was so beautiful that i just wanted bigger <laughs> and um, I'll show them to you of course the packaging is great this is how it comes I'm not going to show you the receipt but basically it's wrapped in the receipt and then I just that's why I just did that so that I didn't have to cut the video um, I have to say the colors are unbelievable this one ugh, I just yeah, it's going to be one of the ones that is hard to use. There is a theme of water. I got, um, of course, I love that one too. The colors are really, really beautiful. And the quality is unbelievable. If you're on the fence, I would say get them because you're not going to regret it. And then the plants. Oh, her, she's just really talented. I love watching her draw with me. And I think she's just, you know, great positive energy and... I do really appreciate her and so I'm really happy <laughs> to have gotten some of them and then I started journaling and I decided to start the camera I had already started but that's fine so the news is I don't use the Hobonichi cousin anymore I've decided to let go of it because it's starting to stress me out because uh, daily junk journaling just doesn't make sense and now my journal is really the pocket what I do love about the Hobonichi cousin I almost wish it was a book where there was just the month and the weekly section and no daily pages. I would totally go for that um, because the month I love doing the recap with my photos and the weekly pages is my gratitude journal. But I could do the gratitude and the tracking in my pocket size large trim and make it almost like a bullet journal. And that is what I'm gonna try next month. I will do the setup, I will shoot it. But for the junk journal, I think the traveler's notebook i had this insert from boom kuchin from like two years ago when they had their superior labor lab where i modified this traveler uh, as notebook so i was really happy to just shut my stash and just try it out and i have to say i really enjoyed it i love the size of the page it didn't feel the pressure and it's just i love how it turned out so yeah i've um i used my decorese for the glitter color on the stencil date um, I will be using the Finitech glittery um, blue, although it comes off a little bit green, and my Kaweco, which I will do an update it because I, I do have a few Kawekos now. <laughs> I've used them for drawing a few times. Um, so yeah, I'm going to leave you to it because it's pretty self-explanatory, but I'll just, um, I'll just have two videos coming up, I guess, one um, showing my Kawekos and one showing my new uh, setup for my pocket size. So I hope everybody enjoyed this video and everybody's uh, healthy and safe and um, happy. And thank you for watching. Bye-bye.